Or, you know, just being good with purples, I guess. You know, the purples are pretty overpowered in this game, obviously. But it's just like, man, what a mess. Speaking of a mess, I'm real glad we got a fiery Bullblax right at the start, who no doubt has the treasure. Um, yep, sure looks like it. All right, cool. Well, glad I bought a bunch of reds. Glad they're not all completely separating, because, I mean, who wants that, am I right? I sure don't. Uh, okay. Let's just get the cursor meticulously there. So that I may make sure I only have the colors that aren't red. There's one free somewhere. Oh, hello. Hello, you. Um... There's not really a good escape path, except, like, here, I guess. I just have to be careful because I don't want to deal with the fire. Mostly, I just want to have a path I can go where I'm allowed to, like, look around a bit. Because there's probably another treasure in here somewhere. This place is huge, so it would not surprise me. Guys, do you want to get stop- you want to stop being caught on the toilet? That'd be cool. Alright, uh, I'm gonna want to definitely use a bitter spray here, because, quite frankly, I do not trust this scenario in the slightest. I don't know. Fiery Bull Blacks, I ain't dealing with that guy. He's kind of a problem. Um. Alright. We got an apple, guys. I did it! Apple acquired! It's of my eye. It's the insect condo also. Wow, really? That was it? Really? I would not have expected that to be the only treasure. Okay, well, in that case, I guess President gets to stay there while I go on an adventure to find the hole. I'm only really bringing Pikmin with me on the off chance I need them. Um... Where is it? Still nowhere in sight. There it is. Okay. Man, there's a lot of fire dudes here. Man, it... it I'm okay with these freebie holes, let me tell you. But man, it is always kind of weird when you get holes that are like this that are just freaking huge, and then there's just one treasure and you happen to find it near the base. And then it's like, oh, okay, well now I just gotta figure out where the, the exit is. <laughs> like, cause obviously I have no reason to do anything else. Why would I risk my life? Uh, okay, this hole could be worse. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and not even deal with cannon beetles today, so... Given this is a much more open area, I'm well aware the boulders were probably affected by the sand, but that's okay, I can figure that geometry out. Alright, you... I need to get not the captain sucked up, though. Is there any chance that'll hit the jelly float? I mean, I guess it could. The jelly float being here does kind of produce a bit of a strange happenstance. Uh, oh, I almost got it, but I missed. Also, he's moving a whole lot, which makes me sad. Wish you'd stop moving over there, buddy. Wish you'd stop moving. Everything would have been, oh, hey, I did actually hit the jelly float. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right, that guy's almost dead. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just finish him off, I think, cause, heck. <laughs> All right. Maybe I should have used him to get more done, possibly. I don't see anything behind like any of these walls. Kinda, what is the point, actually? All right, well. If I go over here, chances are real good that, yeah, this guy will just come over here to me and not be a threat in the slightest. So that's cool. I am gonna, however, have to fight the other guy because he's sucking up my friends and I, quite frankly, do not approve. Uh, I need you to come back though because I don't want Boulder Man to get interested in what I'm doing here today. To be honest. Not a, not a favorite idea of mine. Guy, get over here. I need to destroy this jelly float. I need to, like, aim my Pikmin properly so that I actually, like, hit him. 
I kind of really don't need you guys carrying that away right now because we have a more pressing issue here. Please get out of the sand pit. Please get out of this. Please get out of the sand pit. All right, now we can carry it. It's easy. See, it's easy. When a plan comes together like that, it's easy. It's fine, it's great. What even is this? It looks like there's something in it, but I think that's just a weird reflection of what is in the level. Because it's like it's upside down also, which is weird. Glass spheres are weird, so I guess that's expected. Uh, where is the exit? I didn't even see it. Um, I mean, no doubt it's behind one of the walls. Was it back near the start and I just kind of forgot about it? That's always possible. Oh, it's over there. I see it now. I see you now. I was gonna say, I can't wait for that boulder to just ruin me because it happens to thread the needle between various walls here. That will be my favorite. Anything here? There's something here. I mean, I'll take it. I'd have preferred maybe, you know, I am gonna probably look around here only because there is a chance of like a queen candy pop bud or something. Guys, I need you to move because I just don't trust that guy. Because it would not surprise me if he could somehow just thread the needle. Please turn around. Please, you're not even, you're coming closer actually. That's arguably worse. All right, well, I'll just get by you then. It's fine. I I don't I don't even care about your face. All right, more nectar. That's cool. Yeah, I'm just going to keep looking around and see if I find anything. Wow. The last 3 just blatantly had nothing in them. The other ones at least had eggs with nectar. Weird. Anyway, let's just go. <laughs> I don't know, I was just hoping there'd be like a queen candy pop bud or something. I don't remember there being bold men in this dungeon at all. But I, there could be queen candy pop buds hidden. Oh gosh, is this the floor I think it is? Because I hate this one. It probably is. Yeah, no, it is. Okay. This is just a mess of a floor. Uh, okay. Do not be afraid to use sprays, is the name of the game. I need to get rid of Pluffy here, because he is a bit of a problem. Well, mostly I need to get rid of anything that's doing me a bunch of, like, problems here. I don't like that there's a bomb there now, so I'm gonna evacuate. Because this is just like a combination of dudes that is literally set up in such a way to make it so that you are going to get blown up. Like, bumbling snitch bug, causing all of your Pikmin to dismiss at a really bad time. Very likely possibility. <laughs> um, this guy causing your Pikmin to dismiss at a really bad time. Also, very likely possibility. I kind of wish the bomb would have killed him, but I guess we can't always be that lucky. Alright, as long as I can carve out a safety area, things will be fine. Okay, let's get you the heck out of here. I'm not a fan of that bomb being on a hill. I'm not going to chance that yet. Let's just get you back down on the ground. Alright, I've carved out a safe here. I've had times where you just kind of spawn in this area and there's like very little you can do. <laughs> like, cause they, they got like just the right combination of dudes that refuse to separate from each other. So I'm kind of happy if any of the floors went okay, it was this one. Cause I have had this floor go completely awry really quick. It's still not over, don't be confused, but um... We're better at this point. Let's get you down on the ground. I'm kind of hoping the bomb will do something, but I don't think it will. This guy has very weird hit detection as far as the bombs go. I know you can hit him, but you have to get like the perfect storm. I really wish you wouldn't didn't back up. Cause uh, I kind of want you to not be near the Dirigi bug. I'm being completely honest. Alright, 
Everything should be good here. That bomb is far away. Please go for the kill. Please just end it. Naturally, you didn't just end it, because that would be convenient. Alright. I think this guy actually has the treasure, also. Alright. Oh gosh, there's a Pikmin over there for reasons? I don't know why he was over there, but let's get this out. Uh, for the record, also, the exit's over there. I'm pretty sure it's plugged up. Yeah, it's definitely plugged up. Uh, that's safe, so I'm just gonna go for it at this point. Oh gosh, I didn't notice the second bumbling snitch bug. I didn't notice that guy at all. Well, that's the essence of desire. So that's pretty cool. Let's... Aw, oh, fart, get off of me. Get, get... No, come on, can we not actually do this right now? That said, I know I said before I'm not a fan of save scumming, but let me tell you, I'm not restarting this. <laughs> okay, just put both of the bumbling snitch bugs, well, not both, but two of them right here in the starting room. Also, I finally did the thing where I can like hit him on the way down. was arguably worse, but because all of the bumbling snitch bugs were over on the other side of the world, I didn't have to worry about them at all during this part. So it took forever to actually find a safe way through, but uh, I did it without any casualties, unlike last time, where it's like, no, you know what? We're just gonna completely cripple you. That's fine, right? It's fine. <laughs> I, this dungeon... <sighs> This dungeon, actually, in general, is just kind of annoying. To be fair, this is kind of the last floor I remember being, like, particularly bad. So, hopefully things will be better from here. Hopefully. I don't know what it is. It's always this floor, it feels. Where it's like, oh, okay, I guess I'm just resetting the game now, because, heck. Because that's just it. Like, literally at this point, it's a time save because, yeah, of course, I can just leave and go restock Pikmin and then come back. Like, it's not even a problem. I probably have enough time in the day to still do it in this particular day. But it's just like, like I can't continue with that, so I kind of don't have a choice. This room, I remember being bad, but not in a hard way. It's just, this is kind of an annoying area that exists. There's like a billion elements going on here. That guy is back. You remember that guy, right? All right. Uh, I feel like before I deal with him, I probably should get rid of various hazards around, actually. Can I reach that from here? I sure can. rid of the fire. Probably should get rid of the electric also. The electric being probably more pertinent actually. Nope. 
and the pumpkin got up. Also, I thought these guys were done. They're not, by the way. I mean, if you want to just land there, that's cool too, I guess. You want to you wanna land in my friend group again? That'd be cool. Let's just see if that happens a third time. Well, I mean, it kind of did. I don't know why my yellows are just sitting there doing nothing though. I don't actually know. All right, well, he's dead, so that's a thing. Yellows, you want to get off of that ledge? I'm, I'm well aware you can do it. The red ones did it. Um, let's just go around disarming the place at this point. Please get up the ledge. I know you guys have leaves, but it shouldn't be that hard. Taking care of the electric. Alright. There's more over there that I should probably deal with. Alright. Takes care of those. There is fire around. Fire is less of a problem right now. So I'm not as concerned. I don't know what happened to you guys. Please actually defeat the power of electricity. Oh, that's cool. They keep sliding off the ledge. It's, it's really good. All right, well, I mean, the deed is done, so it doesn't matter as much. Uh, okay, that actually, I think, is all the electric, so that's pretty good. Um, these guys, the hills here are always a problem got some dudes down in the center which make me not happy but I mean I can deal with that I've had some issues with this guy in the past in the sense that like sometimes he glitches out of bounds so I guess we'll see if that happens again and it'll be hilarious guys get off of that I don't need you fighting him right now mostly because I don't even know what color he is he might be red I think it's red but I can't really tell that guy picked up the corpse over there! What a silly billy. Alright. Yeah, I just kinda... I don't know if I even need to go this way. Because it looks like there's just the one treasure... Well, I think there's two treasures in here, but it looks like there's one over here, and there's nothing over this way. Yeah, thank you for most of my pigment just kinda falling off the ledge here. Alright, well, there goes the poison. Alright. Please stop. Please actually stop. Yeah, there's two treasures, actually. I'm gonna have to go over here as well. Alright. Let's get that going. I still have weights. I still have weights. I still have weights. It's hard to tell sometimes, because naturally, um... The Pikmin don't cycle very good, it feels like, sometimes. Like, sometimes they're just like, oh yeah, you got whites next. Rapidly press A. Here come a, f a bunch of blues and purples. Just for you! I should actually be careful, because I- don't I have Pikmin hanging out somewhere? I'm not gonna lie, for a second there I forgot this was active. I thought I had Pikmin that were idle, like in the center of the room. Is it just these guys? It's weird. Uh, okay, let's deal with Electric Bro. It's, uh, okay, I guess he's gonna climb up the wall. Not a fan of that. Um, Alright, dude, I need to just get one Pikmin on top of you. That's all I need to do. Purple, I don't need you there. Although, I will say, purple existing caused him to get stunned. That would have been pretty nice to have. I saw some whites in there, please do not. I just want yellows. Alright, fine, I guess this is what we're doing. I'm gonna try using the purples I got. I don't like the idea, but um, if they would ever separate, ever, just ever, I just want the purple. I just, just, just the purple. Only purple. Nothing else. There's only two of them, this shouldn't be hard. <laughs> One to stun, and then one to throw. That did a decent chunk of damage. Are you gonna attack when you unstun? I thought I was holding A, but apparently I wasn't. Um, 
Gosh, you gotta be pretty precise with this throw. They have tiny bodies. It's fine. Yeah, being able to stun them, though, is kind of a thing that's of note. So, that's pretty cool. Thank goodness I have purples, right? Thank goodness. Alright. Yeah, it's like they have a bit of a delay before they realize they've been hit, actually. So, that's kind of weird. I'd say, do you want to pick that up and just be out of my hair forever? But also, I'm having an easy enough time killing you, so... That's cool. I'm not sure what to do about this guy over here, though. I say this guy over here knowing full well that, um... This isn't the jack-o'-lantern guy. I don't know where he's at. He's somewhere, obviously. But, uh, you know. This is just the, uh, take it easy and slowly floor, apparently, because, I mean, literally what else am I gonna do in life? Alright, I'm gonna deal with you last, because it seemed like the thing to do. This is mildly scary, because sometimes he just doesn't die quick enough, and it's a problem. But it's fine. It's fine, because you see, I'm winning my with my strategy of using a duo of purples. They've done it. I've found a use for my purples, guys. Oh, I got the Pikmin straight on him. Biggest nice. Alright. I don't know what to do about this guy, because, again, I've had issues with out-of-bounds shenanigans before. Wow, that actually dislodges it immediately? That's cool. I actually was not aware of that. Um, I kind of wish I could hit you like I've done the others. Are you just immune to stun when you're trying to get the thing? Thinking about it, is that thing, like, stuck in the air? Uh, it might be. Okay, I was gonna say, can we please kill that guy? Because I'm not a fan. Alright, purples, your job is done. We can finally, you know, do something in this floor. Hold on, I actually kind of forgot that there were dudes in the center. Can you guys don't? I don't want Olimar. I also don't want bodies right now, because I don't need to... Actually, thinking about it, that might not be a bad thing. Because then the dweevils in the center will just take those instead. So, let's go ahead and do that, I guess. Alright. Get on up here, guys. I know you can do it. I believe in you. Your will is strong. Alright. Let's get that out of here. Yes, please. Fly around in random directions. I need one more. That's cool. Gotta go over here and get this other thing. Alright. I didn't mean to actually go flying off of the ledge. It's not what I wanted to do. Oh, the white guys made it. W weird. I'm a little surprised, if I'm being honest. I kind of wish this Munge Dweevil would um, cease to exist. Pretty please. Uh, thought I had a blue Pikmin on you somewhere, but I guess I don't. Like, I thought I remembered seeing one get thrown. Well, uh, never mind, I guess. Alright, well, uh, that's done. Let's try to get this other treasure so I can get out of this place, because it's taking a while. You'd think it wouldn't, because, like, there's not a lot here. This isn't a very big place, but the combination of dweevils and, you know, a long path to go on possessed squash is here. Uh, but let's also get the Wobblina here. Alright. Yeah, because obviously, like, their intention is like, oh man, you gotta, like, deal with all the dweevils and everything uh, in order to get the treasures down and all that, but, like, heck with that, man. You gotta kill them all. Mostly because you just don't know where your Pikmin are gonna go, and you don't know where the Dweebles are gonna go. Because those things are attracted to treasure like crazy. It'd also be nice if the Pikmin jumped off of ledges that they very clearly can jump off of, but uh, we ain't got time for that, I guess. 
just no time. All right, I, I want to say the next floor is a rest floor. I do remember there being at least one. So, stream perspirator. All right, let's move onward. Down the hole. We progress, it's where we go.